Hassan Ikrada took over as leader of SANDAG in 2018 and soon ruffled feathers. He made climate change the center of his decision making on the type of transportation infrastructure the agency would prioritize. Freeway expansions, which increase greenhouse gas emissions, were paused. Ikrada became the darling of progressives and environmentalists. But conservative opposition to his ideas mounted over the past year, leading to Ikrada's announcement in July that he would step down. His supporters gathered outside Sandag headquarters today, calling on the agency to replace him with someone who shares Ikrada's vision for a less car-dependent San Diego. Someone who will champion community priorities and a long-term sustainability vision. This vision is one that embraces multimodal transportation with options for drivers, public transit riders, cyclists, and walkers alike. Ikrada will officially resign at the end of the year. County Supervisor Nora Vargas, who chairs the Sandag board, said she heard Ikrada's supporters. As we're moving forward uh, with this process, uh, we my com um, commitment to them is that I will be in constant communication uh, with all of them um, to share what that process is and reassure them that we have uh, a strong leadership team that is able to execute the work as we're moving forward. The next CEO of Sandag is unlikely to be as brash as Akrata, but fights over freeway widenings, public transit expansions, and new taxes to pay for those projects will continue. Andrew Bowen, KPBS News.